Let's take a look at the difference between average atomic mass and the mass number. So we're talking about atoms here. The average atomic mass, that's the average mass of the isotopes, different atoms, say of chlorine, in a sample. So right here, that's our average atomic mass. It's usually a decimal, it's below the element symbol. For the mass number, we figure that out based on the number of neutrons. So let's take a look at an isotope of chlorine here. It has 18 neutrons. So that's one common isotope of chlorine. Since the atomic number here, this is the atomic number 17, that's going to equal the number of protons. We have 17 protons. This is neutral. There's no negative or positive. Protons equals electrons since it's neutral. So 17 protons, 17 electrons. And then the mass number, that's protons plus neutrons. So that's a whole number. 18 plus 17 is 35. And we call this the isotope chlorine 35. And the 35, that's the mass number. Let's do another common isotope here of chlorine. So since it's chlorine, it's going to have an atomic number of 17. It'll have 17 protons and then 17 electrons. That doesn't change. But let's say we have an isotope with 20 neutrons. This is pretty common. So we want to figure the mass number out. Protons plus neutrons, 20 plus 17. 37. So chlorine 37, that's another isotope. And this average atomic mass, it's the average of these isotopes here weighted for their abundance, how many there are of each. So that's where this number comes from. These are for individual atoms. You can think of it that way, where this here, it's for a sample of atoms. Let's take a look at that. So the link for this app is in the description here. What we're going to do is look at chlorine. Here's chlorine 35, mass number 35. So we're looking at one atom here, and here's chlorine 37, looking at one atom, one the isotopes of chlorine. But let's look at a sample, something we might find in nature. So when we look at this, the purple, that's the chlorine 35 atoms, chlorine 37's the green, and we can see most of them are chlorine 35, 75% chlorine 35 isotope, about 24% chlorine 37. But when we average them based on abundance, how many they are, we end up with 35.45. 35.45, that, that's our average atomic mass that we were talking about before. So that's it. This is Dr. B looking at the difference between average atomic mass and the mass number. Mass number applies to a specific isotope or a specific atom, where the average atomic mass, that's the averages of those isotopes for that element based on abundance. Thanks for watching.